What a cracking response to the video I put out yesterday on the uh, Surrey Connect bus service, the new bus service launched by Surrey County Council uh, in Surrey Heath. Um, I trialled the service yesterday, as my video showed, and um, it worked flawlessly. I think, though, uh, it's important that I um, correct a few things because in my enthusiasm for uh, the service and how well it worked, but also uh, based on the, the press release that I'd read from Surrey County Council, I think I might have over-egged the pudding just a little bit, um, and I just want to correct a few of the things that I said yesterday because it doesn't cover the whole of Surrey Heath. Um, quite a few residents came on um, my Facebook page in the comments and said, oh, well, I've just tried to um, you know, register the app and I was looking at bus stops near my area and it doesn't seem to cover my area. Um, and that's because, so this morning, I, based on that feedback, I requested a meeting with the um, lead officer of the passenger transport group um, department responsible for Surrey Connect. And he very kindly met me at very short notice and explained the service in detail to me um, and explained uh, some of its limitations. And that is that um, the bus service is not actually meant to uh, replace the, the bus services that already exist. So in my own area of um, Mitchick, Frimley Green and Deepcut, and in particular Deepcut where I actually live and where I'm sat right now, um, we're serviced by two buses, the number 11 and the number 12. Um, but they, those two bus services don't go to all areas. Um, so I was quite lucky yesterday when I, when I uh, requested a bus uh, to go to Bagshot because you can't get a bus to Bagshot from Deep Cut uh, without going all around the houses and, and via uh, several places. Um, you know, the, that, that service works perfectly for me. And the, that is the whole idea of it, is to plug gaps in existing services. The other thing is important that the service doesn't uh, compete with the of the, the existing bus services because we need to make sure that those bus services remain viable because if they're not as commercial uh, entities you know the the bus operator could pull those services and obviously that's the last thing that we want um, that said however if you live in an area where recently bus services may have changed uh, the schedules or the routes may have changed uh, or you're in an area where you think um you know, it could be better served by buses. My advice to you is to contact your county councillor. So if I'm your county councillor, so if you live in Mitchett, Frimley Green and Deep Cut, get in touch with me and let me know because I can then talk to the passenger transport group and ask them to include your area or a destination in, um, the, you know, the, the, the route schedule of Surrey Connect. And a good example of that uh, some of the feedback that I got from some of the residents on my Facebook yes page yesterday was that um, Farnborough North Station is not included. Um, uh, neither is Farnborough North. Um, North Camp and Farnborough North, do beg your pardon, that they're not included. And um, as strategic locations where lots of people are going to want to use uh, the service to get them to those train stations, um, you know, I think it's fair that they're included. So I gave that feedback to the passenger transport group today. They were very receptive to the idea. They couldn't give me a guarantee that it would be included, but they are going to go away and look at it very carefully, as well as Mitchett, which also appears to have some gaps. Um, so they're going to look at that too. They're going to go away. They're going to look at these things. They're going to come back to me, they said, hopefully next week to let me know what they've found and to see if those locations and strategic uh, places like the train stations can be included. Like I say, no guarantees, but, you know, uh, nothing ventured, nothing gained. So I'm still very excited about Surrey Connect. I think it's a great service. I'm sure residents who use it will agree. Um, but do feedback to me if you feel that the service is not covering your area or there are gaps in the uh, existing service, uh, and I will get that looked into. And make sure if you don't live in Mitchett, Frimley Green and Deep Cut, that you contact your own county councillor. And I will provide a link where you can find out who your county councillor is if you don't already know. So uh, like I said in my video yesterday, do explore the app. Do go on the Surrey Connect website. Check out if your area is covered. 
and that the places you want to go to are covered because I really do believe that that service is a viable alternative to the car.